Welcome to Housing Technology 2017, our largest conference ever. Come to the Housing Tech Conference because it's a great place to network. BT are very interested in HAs and we always find something new out that we didn't know before, so it's always a great event to attend. Everyone says to us, if you're serious about tackling the housing market, you need to be at this event and you can't afford not to. For us to partner with Housing Technology to, to take our technology and our message out to how we can help the sector innovate and modernise their, their legacy IT landscapes is a really great opportunity to do so through this conference. It's a great place to come to, meet all the decision makers within the IT departments of the housing associations and meeting people who are really wanting to transform the way that their organisations are working. I actually think this year has been one of the best. There's about 30% more people I would say this year than, than most other years so uh, it's been excellent. We've had the opportunity to speak to a lot of people we haven't spoken to in the past. New people to the sector as well who come from you know the private sector back into housing but also as well people who we've spoken to for many years and maybe now is the right time for us to start engaging with them. Well, we find it's one of the best attended conferences in the, in the sector really and it's, it's a good range of uh, exhibitors and uh, very wide range of delegates as well. It's great just to have this opportunity to, to engage with housing associations the way we do and um, it's always informative and uh, a great event. I think the big challenge is, is digital at the moment. People are really struggling to get tenants on board. Digital transformation, that's something that's really important to our customers and I think the reason for that is, or one of the reasons for that is, the customers of our customers are transforming digitally. Lots of organisations are recognising that they need to do things and also recognising that there are opportunities even though that it requires investment, that investment is actually going to pay back. The biggest challenge is social customer service, ways in which that using a service like Hoots we can help them best serve their tenants, best deal with any challenges and best deal with making sure that they're well loved and they're well looked after. Sort of buzzword is the big data and what's going on and, 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 and collating that data and making sure that it's freely available for people but the other thing I'm hearing as well is it's got to be easy for people to use. I think there's a lot of focus here so it's IT challenges and problems that you know our organisations here are facing um, because the capital is a good fit in terms of solution offering and service offerings it's a really good fit to what people are coming here to talk about. Ladies and gentlemen, Alexis Conrad. Today I'm specifically going to talk to you about um, systems and why systems fail. First time I've come to a housing technology conference, I'm Chief Exec at Bromford and like many others we've embarked on a major comprehensive business transformation process and I guess the soundbite answer is I think technology is too important to leave to ICT teams. Well obviously being in sector this is probably the, uh, the primary event um, and it's a great place for networking and actually it's always interesting to see which vendors are here according to what the uh, kind of zeitgeist is at the time. It's just brilliant to see the, what, what the uh, customers are, are doing with the products, where the market's going. Some of the things that they've done is absolutely fantastic. For us it's uh, important to come to these kind of events to listen to the presentation and see you know, first hand how others have gone through that process already. Also networking is, is a major thing for me is to meet other similar like-minded professionals to see where they are and their business and if they're also experiencing the same kind of you know, issues that we face. We've gone through a massive implementation, it's been really successful and now we need to take it to the next stage and it's understanding what that next stage could look like. So many exciting products out there, Internet of Things, smart apps, it's just understanding what will work for its best as a business and how we can serve our customers best really. We've got lots of ideas, lots of more ideas than we can know what to do with uh, and we're going to go back to the office now and write them all down, put them in a tender document and hope that you know, one of these people here today win the tender. <laughs>